our guests tonight have promised to help us put the wintry misery to one side, to forget all about the cold, those <laughs> chilly temperatures. The thing is, you see, they're in a play together and it's called... Um, what's it called again? It's, it's called Frozen. <laughs> OK. Well, please welcome Sir Anne Jones and Jason Watkins. <laughs> Welcome to the one show. Welcome, Mark. Very well. Yeah. I mean, Jason, you're used to knocking around these parts. Uh, you know, yeah. but usually we on a fold-up well, bike. I, oh yes, I, yeah, I didn't come in on my bike today, but uh, I usually. I, oh, there I am. Isn't that? Isn't yeah. that there attractive? you are. That is a good look, isn't it? Uh, yeah. No, I run the building. I'm... You come to rehearsals <laughs> like that, though. I. I've actually got a road bike when I come oh, to rehearsal. Yeah. Sorry, I mean, it's obviously the BBC isn't uh, worth a road bike, actually. <laughs> but I used to go to the but, uh, yes, no, I do. I cycle into work. Yes. Well, let's topically talk about the NTA Awards. Uh, yeah. You're up for one tomorrow. Actually, you put your uh, yeah, line right. of duties up. Yeah, well, that's right, yeah. Tomorrow. Yeah. So I'm do not you... up for an individual award. I don't know how that happened, but... There you go. Don't worry. <laughs> it's okay. Neither are we. We'll Neither are we. Over. We're not even going to go there. Uh, but do you, do you enjoy an evening like the NTA? Um, is it... Well, because we're at rehearsals. Mm. Like, today we're at rehearsals, and then we kind of, like, I shot off and then... And to come here and then Jason followed me so tomorrow we're in the morning then I'm gonna run off and I haven't even got my outfit yet right. so that's a big thing that I need to do I'm gonna do it when I arrive at the hotel to get ready and hopefully there'll be something to wear right. <laughs> so do leave it right till then hopefully fire. there'll be something to wear if not yeah. I'll just go in this this looks all right <laughs> what you just keep wearing it <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> until someone says it off yeah Good yeah night. perfect well, so around that brings us on to the topic of your play, Frozen, mm -hmm. and you have been working with the charity to prepare for this, right? Yeah, so um, my character is, uh, she has a missing daughter, and we, th we just, within the first weeks of rehearsal, we thought it was really important to involve um, charities like Missing People, and what they did was they introduced me to three parents, and two of the mothers came in to talk to us about, um, and their children were still missing, because it's entertainment and it's a play but actually when you're dealing with themes like this I think mm. it's really important to do your research um, in, in the correct way and it was really brave of those women to come in yeah. and kind of talk to us about um, their experiences and, and, and how they were feeling and we also had a criminologist which takes us on to Jason's character um, and we find out what happened to my daughter mm -hmm. um, throughout the play the play runs over 20 years yeah. And I get the opportunity to meet the person that is perhaps responsible for my daughter going missing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I mean, obviously, there's a lot of mystery surrounding this. We don't want to go yeah. into the detail of the plot, yeah. but yeah, Jason, what would you like to say about about your perspective on this, your character? Well, I mean, it's great watching that uh, piece, isn't it? And uh, there's a huge empathy for people who are um, missing children, and I think this play has a strong theme of empathy and understanding and Strand's absolutely right you when you're doing a play you really want to get into the real the reality of it and we've, we've both had success in television playing complex and interesting characters and this yeah. is an opportunity to do that in this yeah. play yeah. and the more that you reflect society and individuals in society accurately and with empathy I think that 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 begins to make evenings very special and uh, something about the live element of watching incredibly complex difficult challenging characters in difficult situations that uh, makes theatre a special thing mm. uh, and so one always looks for those kind of characters in whatever medium and uh, certainly this play has three Nina Sasania plays uh, a psychologist a criminologist who comes to study um, my character mm -hmm. and so uh, there's that element as well and we've been working with Professor David Wilson who's expert criminologist so we, we try and touch base in reality mm. okay well l let's have a little look at the most glossy trailer we've <laughs> ever seen for a stage play yeah this is it. something else this they say missing children often phone on their birthdays when she comes back everything will be nice the same familiar rona where are you I know you're somewhere. I tell you what, Ooh, shivers. Ice. The We're watching shivers. that. Oh. We're watching it so intently because I, I was just saying in the break, um, it's mainly monologues. So it's, this is a mm. Bryony Lavery play directed by the brilliant Jonathan Monby, and uh, there's a lot of monologues, as the trailer suggests. They're quite. Um, singular stories so I've, I haven't actually been rehearsing with Jason and I haven't 
I don't know if he's any good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I will hopefully find out. Listen, it don't worry. Really should, I will ruin the evening. So, but uh, you look really good on the trailer. I know. Yeah. I'm actually better on screen. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> but you have a lot of good friends, don't you? So maybe you did you get a heads up about whether he's any good? I did. Well, actually, Vicky McClure is responsible for giving away a big secret. But you oh, said you weren't going to say that. Well, it's too late. It's too late. Hang on. I'm very good at handstands. Stop it. Are you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. no, no I mean, what has that football, got to do with that? handstands? Yeah. yeah we can't Extraordinary at handstands. <clears throat> and he's been trying to teach me how to cartwheel. That's what we've been doing in, like, in yeah. between our rehearsals. What's your record with the handstands? What do you mean in terms of distance? Well, I what, oh, distance? Got, hang on, hang on. We've got different categories. Well, it's like, a fo uh, like uh, almost a football pitch. I mean, I couldn't do that now. Um, yeah. I used to do uh, run the length of a basketball court when I was about so 14, and I got quite close to the world record for running on my hands. Did you? Yeah. It's so important. Clearly can't do that now. I've slipped a disc, otherwise I yeah. would mo I would have given you a handstand. Here we go. Sure. Here but we if go. you would like the floor, Absolutely. I mean, feel free to do one if you fancy one. It's entirely up to yourself. Before the end yeah. of the All program. Awkward silence. <laughs> Let's Don't talk silence. Don't I mean, I will, I will do one if you want me to, but, I mean, um, I'd love it if you did. Oh, he can't yeah. because he's so do a down challenge back. Right. 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 The, jo the joke is... I'll be all right. I, I, I can warm up slightly. The joke Hang is on. that I do Let's this do at quickly. every single party, every this social occasion, right. every chat show. This is like this is like if you want to do it. Yeah, I'll do it. Do you want a bit of room? I'll go this oh. side. You go that side. Here we go. Oh, Ready? I'm gonna do it with a jacket really on as well. I can't believe this. Ready? All right. All right. Be careful. There we go. We're in it. There you go. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. It was slightly awkward how we went from the topic of what we were talking about yeah. into a handstand competition. You, we need that wasn't lights. planned, can we just say? That yeah. wasn't planned. Yeah. Really? It felt oh. seamless to me. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Frozen, would you ever get back to the, the play? Uh, it's on for 12 weeks only at the Theatre Royal Hair Market. In, listen to my voice, it's gone weird. Oh, no. <laughs> it uh, it starts right on, on the 9th of February. There we are. And that isn't in it. That no, that's, no, it's not about handstands no, no at all. Pieces in it. Right, Very about, yeah. Well, from royalty to comedy royalty, <laughs> Jason, you're working with John Cleese on a sitcom at the moment. Yeah, I've got a sitcom coming out on BBC One uh, in a couple of months, or a few weeks, called Hold the Sunset. Oh. And uh, it's John Cleese, Alison Stedman, uh, Anne Reid, myself. Uh, and, uh, yeah, it's great. It's very funny. And um, I'm looking forward to it uh, being transmitted, yeah. Yeah. Well, you had such a busy year last year, so you're not slowing down then this year, just cracking up. No, no, I seem to be covering a few of the uh, Monty Pythons. Uh, I did um, a film called uh, The Man Who Killed Don Quixote, which is a Terry Gillingham film, which oh, yeah. he tried to make 20 years ago with Johnny Depp. It's now Adam Driver is now the, le the lead and uh, Jonathan Price. Yes. So, uh, yeah, I had a part in that, so I spent sort of like the spring in, uh, in Spain and Portugal. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, yeah. and so, And, Saran, you were working with Michael Palin on Vanity... I did a couple of days on Vanity yeah. Fair, yeah, because yeah. the brilliant Olivia Cook is um, playing the lead. Yeah, so I had fun, yeah. But back with your old pal Sally Wayne, Wainwright. Um, yeah, so we start filming Gentleman Jack in May, okay. mm -hmm. um, and we do that May to December. And um, uh, I play Anne Lister of Shivden Hall, and uh, she left five million words of a diary. And uh, six of those diaries were in crypt hand or code, right. because they talked about her lovers. Um, and so she is a, um, a lesbian landowner, entrepreneur, diarist of the 19th century who girl. was hidden away and now um, we get to celebrate her um, because the diaries were hidden away and that part of her diaries were hidden away. So, and Sally has written eight beautiful scripts and I can't wait to celebrate this woman who should have been celebrated years ago. But anyway, we're going to do it now. God, well, you can concentrate that. After you yeah. finish the play, we wish you all the very yeah, best with it. Best. Thanks for your company tonight. Yeah. Haven't yeah. it been marvellous? Yeah. Yeah.